Hi, in this video, I would like to introduce you to the additional RDM tools Luminate Monitor can offer you. If you go onto the top toolbar and you click RDM, you can get access to the sensor view. Here, I'll be able to get access to all the sensors available from the connected devices. In my case, I can see the temperature sensors of the LumiSplit and their DC-DC converter sensors as well. Additionally, I can see also the temperature for the moving lights. You can get access to all the information, such as the minimum range and the minimum level the device can support. The actual level, currently the LumiSplit is at 44 degrees, and the maximum level it supports. The good thing about it is that you can set a maximum alarm value, such as, let's say, 75 degrees. And if the splitter reaches that value, then you can ask the software to send you an email. Of course, the software needs to be connected to the internet to uh, send you an email. So you can select which sensor to con constantly pull and monitor. And you have buttons to refresh them all or only the selected. Another efficient tool is the DMX conflict check. Let's go back to the RDM panel and let's put all the fixtures with the same DMX address. Okay. Now if I use the DMX conflict checked tool, the software will check if there is non-overlapping channels between the devices. Press check. And as you can see, the software is currently complaining. Because this UID, actually this device, conflict with this device, which is normal. And it all will also conflict with that one because they all use the same DMX address. So if you press resolve, the software will offer you to repatch the selected fixtures. In my case, I will go back to first one here, patch, second one here, patch, and the third one here, patch. Now, if I do a check, everything is good because I have just fixed that patch issue. Additionally, and if the device supports it, you can load custom PIDs, but this is for advanced users. Don't hesitate to contact our support team to get more information about this. Thanks for watching.